assalamu alaikum and hello my wonderful viewers i hope you all are very well and as you can see i've gone all green today yes very green because i'm going to cook this very amazing vegetable okra or lady fingers this vegetable has got a lot of health benefits i it's very rich in vitamin C, magnesium, and it's got a lot of uh, other health benefits as well, like it does control your blood sugars, and uh, I thought we'll go all healthy today, as opposed to all those unhealthy recipes we've been doing in, uh, in for the last few times, so all green and healthy today. So I've washed the okra and I've pet them dry. Like this. And cut them in small pieces. Get rid of the head and the tail so I'm gonna cut them in small pieces in like in a slanting position like this So here I've got some baby shallots, which <clears throat> the skin the skin of which I've peeled off, and I'm gonna start the cooking process with frying these in a pan. So I've got here the shallots cooking away in mustard oil, two tablespoons of mustard oil, and about one teaspoon well about half a teaspoon of cumin seeds so we let them cook whilst now we'll mix up some dry spices so i've got here coriander powder so we're going to put in about just under two spoons of coriander powder. About one, one spoon of cumin powder. One spoon chili powder, and about three quarters teaspoons of uh, turmeric powder. We're also going to add some dry mango powder to give it that sari taste. So this is arm chew. About, about one and a half teaspoons of mango powder. And 
some pink Himalayan salt. So that would be about one teaspoon or according to taste. So we'll mix all the spices together. So we're gonna bring our spices and mix our okra in the spices. We'll bring our okra to the stove and put them in the pan where the onions have where the onions have been frying and this let them cook all together. So this will be a very dry dish so I've just had a thought that I will with the same I'll divide this into two and make another dish make another dish with a slight gravy in it so there'll be two dishes two for the price of one I suppose so yeah so once these are cooked I'm gonna add half of this to to a gravy which I will show you how I prepare it <clears throat> so as mentioned I'm preparing the gravy for half of the okras here so I've got some tomatoes and sliced green chilies cooking away in very little oil and here I've got diluted yogurt and gram flour or chickpea flour mix two tablespoons of each which will go in the tomatoes like this so this will be the gravy for our half of our, our okra so we're gonna use the same okra for this gravy with the same spices and everything so as I said these are two different recipes and both are quite delicious eaten with chapati or roti so here it is our bindi do piazza the dry version and the wet version enjoyed with rotis thank you